We'd like to thank everybody for coming out, supporting Kenny today. This uh, float trip is a real special guy to the Washington County community. And uh, we want everybody to be safe and have a good time. And just want to tell everybody we uh, love you, Kenny. And we thank everyone for coming out today. And uh, Eric's going to give you all some announcements. Thank you, sir. Yeah, yeah, bye, guy. Yeah, yeah, bye, guy. Yeah, yeah, bye, guy. <laughs> And uh, I do thank you guys for coming out. And uh, Kenny is our good special friend, and this is all about him today. But um, we do have another friend we need to recognize. Without this, without her, this would not be possible. She is the mastermind behind this. So we, you don't have to speak. You don't have to speak. We, the Wetneck Gap Club, have just a little gift we wanted to uh, give you. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you for your hard work. All right, now Greg Moore is going to do our prayer. Thank you, Eric. My name is Greg Moore. I'm going to give you a little bit of context. I know most of y'all know each other. So just to give you a little context of how I'm, I know Kenny is I'm a vendor for bulk chemical services, and I come out, you know, every month, and I've been coming out for four or five years and meeting with Kenny and Zach and uh, gotten to know them real well. So over the course of the past year, when... I found out about this, you know, Kenny started telling me about what he's going through and uh, every month I'd come out, we'd pray, you know, and so I've kind of kept getting updates every month and I'd call him from time to time and praying for him and just kind of keeping up. And then when he was in Atlanta, I live in Atlanta. So when he was in Atlanta, you know, I was, when I was around town, I'd try to go by and see him a couple times a week or as often as I could because if I was in a hotel, if I was in a uh, hospital room, not a hotel room, for six weeks or more, I'd, I'd probably be losing my mind too. So anyway, um, I've been looking forward to this for about a month and a half. And I, ever since Jessica mentioned it to me, I said, I'll be there, I'm coming, it's going to be good. And I've been, as I've been thinking about it and praying about it, I was thinking this thing represents two things. The main thing to me it represents is Kenny has his next chemo next his last chemo next week. Woo! To me I I got the impression this is a bookend. This is done. So when I pray I'm gonna pray a declaration that it just kind of this is a chapter that's over. And the victory is is that when you beat cancer you got a testimony. Right. And then you when you're a cancer survivor and you say your testimony, it carries a lot of weight to somebody who's got cancer. The other thing that I was thinking about is, is that all of this that's come together and everything, Jessica spearheaded it and everybody's here and all of this community that knows Kenny, I was just asking the Lord about it and he was like, this will represent, this, Jessica was telling me about, hey, this is the biggest event that they told me the Greenway's ever had. And then she starts telling me about the fire, de you know, the fire, de you know, I knew the fire department's going to be here. That's a phenomenal. And then they said, hey, well, they're going to let ri water down the river for us. I mean, I, don't, I wish we could record everything because it would be amazing testimony in and of itself. And everybody here is a part of that. But what that did is I, I believe the Lord's burst something here for Milledgeville and for Sandersville with the community that's here. And what's going on at the Greenway and, and everybody that's had a part of this started some sort of new movement. He's going to do something special here and it's going to change the environment in these communities. So that's what I wanted to say. Those two things. That's the word I believe I got. So I want to declare, Lord, I bless that. And we come into agreement with that. There's more than two or three of us here. We got 50, 100, I don't know, but it carries a lot, and there's a lot of people here in a lot of community. We bless this event, we bless Kenny, and we declare healing on him, and that this is a done deal. There's no more. There's no more. It's over. Kenny is healed in the name of Jesus. And we declare, I just bless what you're doing, Lord. I bless what you're doing in this community, and I release the new thing that you're doing here, Lord. I just pray you keep us all safe today and uh, in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Yeah, yeah, bye, guy. Oh, yeah, yeah, bye, guy. <laughs>
Good work.